What is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back again to Tech Kiran YouTube channel we are talking about Dubfest OS which is available for many devices we have tried and installed it on our device Redmi Note 10 Pro it's available for your device and looks quite good by the way I'm using it from some time the room looks decent enough uh, just one or two things are not great enough but everything else in this custom room is just superb I'm using it for some time and the performance is actually quite quite impressive so you should definitely try out this build we are talking about Dubfest OS which is based on Android version 11 I'm using the official version and also the latest version which has the August security patch as you can see it has the Android version 11 one of the best things I liked about this build as I previously mentioned to you is the performance performance is just one of the great ones out there of course due to that insane kind of performance the battery backup seems to be just normal here or maybe below average you have this kind of launcher pre-installed the launcher is launcher not it's actually looking like shady launcher but unfortunately it's not even a shady launcher it is it's shishu Litius, which is basically a launcher from bootleggers os bootleggers os if you don't know is a very good kind of os good custom room and we have this launcher 3 which is based on shishu launcher by bootleggers room as you can see so it's just based on that but it's basically a shady launcher kind of shady launcher with launcher 3 name version 1.0 of course come with some bit of customizations here too let's just straight away talk about uh, the safety net status that how is the safety net status going on one of the best things i liked about these os right now these custom rooms that the safety net status should be passed uh, all in almost all the custom rooms in almost all the devices only the thing is if you use magisk you definitely need to hide it from settings there and everything else is the same if you don't use magisk if you install a custom room and you don't want to root that safety net status def definitely will be passed and you'll be able to use banking apps on a device which is actually some thing good i'm using some time and the previous time it was not there but now in this meantime we have uh, these things perfectly fine also uh, you get this icon pack pre-installed which is called sims icon pack you can customize the icon size also the sims icon pack is pre-installed this is why the default icon pack was something different and i have not installed anything from third party things this was pre-installed the permission manager is something really good this is how you get the new permissions here also the default camera is the normal snapdragon camera which is not well, even working perfectly fine and i don't think so any of the users use this default this kind of snapdragon camera i don't think so any of you any of you any one of you should use this as if you have the option to use a nx camera you have the option to use a next camera it's not included by the way you can install it very easily the guide is already available on my channel so make sure to check out that you have the option to choose the MIUI camera related things like 64 megapixel documents, vlog mode, slow motion and AIU watermark clone etc. Everything is present here for you and if you have these options why would you use the normal Snapdragon camera. But including this ANX camera you also have the option to choose the Google camera. I also tried the 64 megapixel ultra HD option it was working perfectly fine so using a custom room with these kind of options it's not bad. Even though I tried it playing with MIUI gallery as MIUI gallery is also what I have installed on my device. I was having issues by with this process kind of things I'm not sure why though it's just in my case or maybe it's actually a bug but of course I don't use by the way I don't use me my gallery and I don't use 64 megapixel I haven't read the Google photos by the way but I'll try and I'll share with you but here this is what I got after installing this and after clicking a photo with 64 megapixel also in terms of battery as I previously mentioned to you I just noticed one main issue or major issue or not a major issue that battery backup is just not great enough of course i'm using 120 hertz with more than 80 percent of brightness so it's not that bad but yes just 51 minutes from 97 percent to 86 percent basically 11 to 12 percent of drainage with just 50 minutes of screen on time in my case i don't think so it's great enough but everyone has their preferences everyone has their opinions also everyone has their own perspective of using like how they use if they use dark mode etc so a lot of factors are there in my case i don't like that so let's just move on to this customization section we have all these options present for you like the customizations you get here is same kind of other custom rooms 
like battery backup thing battery related customizations heads up customization heads up notification customizations for you are present for you essential only mode is also present you can also customize the theme and you have approximately 11 themes already included which is something really interesting but you can also create your own custom themes and styles and wallpapers you have the option to do that alongside with that you can customize the quick settings you can customize a lot more extra things so everything depends upon you we have some customizations present if you want to give it a try you can these were things i just wanted to let you know about the stuff first of us which is just one of the great ones and it definitely looks good you should definitely give it a try if you're looking for something different here this is the first OS and I'm testing it. I'm using it on uh, this kind of thing on this related things. So these were things I just want to let you know if you are Redmi Note 10 Pro user go and install this thing and if you still don't want to install and looking for something different it's up to you. And also alongside with that these were things I just want to let you know I hope you like this. If you like this don't forget to like and share this video. If you're new here don't forget to subscribe me. This is all. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the air.